the results you got? Play, play, play every day. How to get to school like that? Look what you got for me. Horse emoji. What is that, what? You think you made your parents proud like that? You happy now? You happy with your results now? Huh? Some say the McKamey Manor is the scariest haunted house in the world. I don't think so. I think what we've created here at the Oxley Asylum is something far worse than your greatest nightmare. We built the Oxley Asylum with one goal in mind, to make you relive your deepest and darkest fears. The concept is actually so simple, it's frightening. It just consists of a single corridor in an abandoned building, and all you have to do is walk down that corridor. And that walk will be the worst five minutes of your life. You know what they say, right? You feel your pain study, you feel for life. Talk in class, some more. Play your country eraser, some more. You tell me now, which school I want you now? Oxley Asylum hired me a couple weeks back in preparation for the Halloween season, actually. I would say it's more of a psychological torment than a haunted house. I just give out PSLE results and uh, actually I get bonuses every time I make someone cry which to be honest is way easier than I thought. A lot of people question why Oxley Asylum is open in the middle of the day. I think it's more real that way. I mean, have you ever received PSLE results at night? When I signed up for the Oxley Asylum, I didn't know that there was going to be this kind of haunted house. They basically, they just made me fill out a Google form with all my personal information. And I didn't even know why Miss Dumbledore was there. I'm definitely never going back. The reason why we ask them to fill out that Google form before they come is because Oxy Asylum isn't just a regular haunted house. It's a personalised hell. We make sure to do our thorough research on everyone visiting the house. We check their Facebook profiles, we ask their friends, we even ask their superiors and colleagues at work. We do everything. And when they come, they won't know what hit them. Just making a molehill in a mountain. This gen this generation is so weak one, very strawberry. Not like me. I'm not scared of anything. <laughs> one. I think I underestimated how scary this haunted house was gonna be. I, I, re I really thought I was brave enough to, to handle it, but I, I wasn't expecting to see my power hungry, verbally abusive leave blocking in Jake waiting for me in the hallway. Well, at least they gave me a free 30-minute therapy session from one of their sponsors, so <laughs> I guess that's where I'm headed after this. What am I scared of? Well, we built a thriving haunted house in the past 55 years, and the progress results so far have been amazing. And the last thing I want is for some foreigner to tell me I can't psychologically abuse my participants this way because, I mean, that's how we assure results. But I'm not scared of the foreigner. I'm scared of the opposition. If one day, our people decide that what we're doing is illegal, they could vote to shut us down. Chills. Literal chills.